Alright, what's up guys? It's Sukun here, and today I'm playing more of Palune, or Lune for short. They uh, had a few updates since the last time I made a video, and yeah. So, first things first, you may notice from the last video, is that they added a new map. If there's a place you gotta go, I'm the one you need to know, I'm the map. It's okay, I don't really see what these uh, houses have anything to do with the actual game, but it adds a little bit of a taste to it more of a vibe to the game you have passed the vibe check they've added a, another ability called Verante Verante hope I'm saying that right it seems to just be like kind of like a, a Sephiroth wannabe kind of because <laughs> it is a massively long I would say this is an Odachi at this point. This is a this is not a katana. This is an Odachi. They also have added some ranked mode, and that is what we're going to be doing today: is playing ranked with this uh, new ability. So yeah, let's hop into it. Okay, here we go. I like this map. I had recommended that they added ranked, and they did. I mean, to be fair, it's just natural for battlegrounds games to add ranked to some, at some point. I'm glad that they did. They listen to the suggestion. I know they don't watch my stuff, but it's still cool that they added it anyways. Oh. For me, yeah, put that guard down. Yeah, that's what I thought. Whoa, there's older. Whoa, whoa, he hit me in his kendo combo, bro. I did not know this was type soul. Whoosh. Nah, why am I getting egoed? Sorry guys, I get a little big ego when I'm winning. Whoosh! What's Thunder Cleave do? I have no idea what any of my abilities do, any, uh, my abilities do so we're just kind of doing this like... Alright. That was a close one. I was gonna say GG, but it didn't let me. Um, is this the ranked queue? Why the hell am I in Germany? Wait, why am I back in the map? Oh, nah, wait a minute. Hold on. Don't tell me every single time you get out of a ranked queue, you have to go back into the actual map and then go back into the ranked queue. Y'all know what's going on. And so do I. <laughs> Oh my god, you have to do that. That is so dumb. I'm sorry. That that is a dumb decision. It should just be its own server. You don't you just kick ready up and you just go into the next fight. You know what I mean? You shouldn't have to just continuously, continuously click join Q America. Right? It, it should just be it should just you know be continuous and you know Bro, it's not even looking at me this time. He parried my move. Okay. He left the game. Yeah, why am I returning to the main game? That is so dumb. And why am I on a server? Nope. <laughs> okay. Okay. It's whatever, I suppose. I'm just kind of rage babying right now. But yeah, doesn't that make... That doesn't make any sense, no, guys? Hello? It's like the idea of, like... It should just you know promote continuous fighting continuous action continuous 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 you shouldn't have a pause unless like you know you're in the waiting the lobby right but i have to click i mean it's not that long right it's not but like still it's annoying that i have to go up here and click that anyways i think you get the point enough yapping about that let's try to find a dummy to test on for these new abilities i know i kind of did this out of order you know i want to just jump into ranked but i should actually review the ability itself Ability one. You toss out a bolt of lightning. Cerberus bolt. Ability two. 
you dash left and right and then come down for a what appears to be like an overhead swing type of move anyways number three storm carve wow okay so you do like an underhand sweep upwards and you know put them up in the air and just start lightning striking them all right and then number four thunder cleave just a big just straight slash and it appears that there's an effect so i'm not sure if like you have to hit like a certain amount of like, abilities to get that stacked up yeah it disappears so i'm assuming once that circle reaches like maximum output it does a bunch of damage i'm assuming i don't have any like player friends or anything i can test it on um but yeah that that's cool i like this ability it's definitely like a a better one than like the the which one did i say i liked but it was like it would have been better alfiel this one yeah if if alfiel let me just double check nope that's the wrong one my fault if cat where the hell is it okay yeah this one i was like complaining like oh my god i'm switching between like all these different weapons it'd be cool if it was just like the sword you know what i mean and i got that with Vante. it's just a sword just raw i just came back from one of the diddy parties shan you should have been there okay um this pure or dachi gameplay okay i really do wish like the running animation was like maybe like a bit different this seems just kind of defaulty for like a sword animation but i do like the idle animation i like the vfx effects on the sword itself i do like the detail on the um I forgot what this call is called on a I think it's called the Saya. No, 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 that's the that's the sheaf, but the guard and the hilt, I like that. I am a fan of that. Yeah, it's very cool. And I'm I'm not sure what this bar is, but like I'm assuming like if you hit a certain ability, I'm assuming it's like Alfiel and like the ice variations. If you have like a full bar and you do like a four or something, it does like this like trip this double slam with his uh the hammer. Uh, but other than that, it's good. Uh, and I don't really have any like problems with this class per se. I'm assuming E for discharge is when I have the hold on, let's go test this real quick. Yep, okay. So if they have the, that circle on them and you press E, it does a track on projectile, which is cool. Do they get one if you hit a full chain of the M1? Okay, so first suggestion for this that i'm finding out right now is that if you hit a full m1 combo they should be given a a uh the discharge buff thing or debuff that that it should reward m1ing does that make sense it, it shouldn't just be abilities abilities that's the only way to get your passive to activate you know what i mean it should also promote m1ing and also now i'm thinking about it this map may be a bit too big and to like closed off like what is the point of this area i mean i guess unless you're trying to have private private sessions pause but other than that this update's interesting it doesn't add that much into the last time i played but it's still something to note ranked is pretty cool just that you know bear in mind that suggestion i had and yeah that's pretty much it thanks for watching